Hi guys, recently I went to Chicago and stayed at the Chicago Parthenon Hostel, which was kind of a neat and interesting experience. I didn't see much on the internet about it, so I decided to show you around in kind of a discreet way. Hey guys, I wanted to show y'all the, um, the Chicago Parthenon Hostel. It's in Greektown. We are staying here because my husband and his friend are were staying here because they're seeing a wrestling show. I'm not seeing the wrestling show, but I did want to come visit Chicago. And this is where they were staying. And I couldn't get a private room with my husband, so I am staying with three other ladies who are not here. I'm not going to show like their, well, you can see some of their belongings in the back, but I'm not going to zoom in on this um i just wanted to show you what the room basically looked like i'm doing this in a mirror so there's a little uh desk and chair trash can um there's some lockers i gotta figure out how to get a lock for uh, my belongings okay so i'm in my bunk now um uh, apparently you have to buy your own lock for your lockers. I don't really have that much that can be stolen. I mean, really nothing. <laughs> I mean, unless you want my clothes. And I'll have my stuff, most of my stuff with me at all times anyway. But um, yeah, that's just a quick tour. I don't know if I'll be able to get the guys room because I don't think I'm allowed in there. But um, yeah. We'll see. So just a heads up, this is how big your opening is to your bunk bed. It's not very big. Um, so if you're a bigger person, maybe you can ask for a bottom bunk. I don't know if you can or not. I think my friend who booked this for me was just like, yeah, she needs a bed. And they just gave me um, this bed. So I don't know, but yeah, I found I even I'm a small person I find it kind of small like I wish there was more opening here and if I had to guess this is probably two feet wide from one to one maybe you can you could put your butt here and then start going down but um if you're a smaller person like being on this top bed it's not great. A bigger person might have problems with it as well. Oh, and maybe this is being really, really picky, and I'm sorry if it is. By the way, no one's um, on the bottom bunk anymore, so I feel comfortable showing that. But anyway, um, I feel like this is a long step from here to the floor. Um, I feel like I'm on it and then I have to go really far down to catch the floor. So, um, that may also bother people. Here are the showers. Looks like they have soap, maybe. I did bring my own. Um, and they have two stalls on this floor, at least. Hear these stairs. There's some um, pamphlets, what you can do in Chicago. It's a beautiful mural. Shin it on, I believe. By the way, while looking around the common room here, it reminded me that the fridge was basically exploding with food. They did say that they clean it, but that it fills up quickly, probably from people leaving food behind, coming in and just leaving it behind and forgetting about it. I'd also like to note that the two nights I stayed only cost $91, so maybe that'll help someone. Thanks for watching, guys. Bye.